columnidae of friends, entomologists and lovers of insects who are interested in the order of Hymenoptera, who is interested in ants, bees, in wasps, in predaceous wasps, in parasitic wasps, so in sawflies. Today we will be talking about parasitic wasp of a family of different families from the super family Chalcididae or Chalcid wasps. Also about some another parasitic wasp or the super family Ichneumonidae. And today I decided not to show just a video, but mostly I will show different slides. Slides about my different parasitic wasp or different families with bigger magnification pictures and with some explanations. And I will show you my presentations, which I did in Ankara, the capital of Turkish Republic, where I had a research visit and where I was studying. And then I did just several times I did a presentation about parasitic wasps. So this is, was a generalization about some results about some parasitic wasps, which were studied, collected and investigated during this my research in Ankara, the capital of Turkish Republic. So I'm now just in Kyiv, the capital of Ukraine, but this presentation will be about biodiversity of Chalcid wasp parasitic and Phytophagus Chalcid wasp presented in Ankara, Turkish Republic, and in some surroundings in different areas of, we will say, eastern, north part of Turkish Republic because Turkey, Turkey is approximately maybe four times bigger than Ukraine. So I visited only left part of Turkey to the west from Ankara, Ankara on the north. So this is western, northern and partially southern part Ankara till the Denizli and some regions near the Syria. Well, but I have not been in mountain areas just on the north and just on mountain area in Diyarbakir and in some mountain area near Iran. So maybe next time, who knows, everything is known. So my presentation will be in English definitely, because uh, it's not politely to present you the presentation in Turkish language, but English is internationally recognized language, so it can be understood in Ukraine, in Turkish Republic and in other places where we want some Indian people watching me just asking some questions about cooperation. Just today one person asked about cooperation regarding study of calcid wasp. So this is possible, why not? So let's try to communicate and explain your interest about parasitic wasp, about entomophagous wasp, about material which you collected, what you studied, what you got and what is interesting in cooperation. Let's start from the presentation. I will show you and explain slides one by one with details. So I add to the stream my slides with original photos and I will explain what's going on on these slides. Okay, this presentation will be about egg parasitoids of a family Trichogrammatidae and other parasitic and entomophagos and phytophagos wasps from an order Hymenoptera as natural enemies of agricultural crops in Turkish Republic. What is about aims of our study? Aims of our study, in general, we can say the study of the biodiversity of family Trichogrammatidae parasitoids and also biodiversity of other parasitic and, and, and phytophagous wasp of a family of superfamily Calcidaidae. Regarding family Trichogrammatidae, the smallest sized calcid wasp, the smallest is belonging to the genus Megafragma. So we have a very wide variety of hosts. Hosts, these are insects which are used like a meal for parasitoids. So parasitoids are laying eggs inside eggs of their hosts. Of which are belonging to 11 orders, different interesting, surprising places for egg of a positioning. So egg places may be very, very different. So host belonging to orders, Orthoptera, grasshoppers, Odonata, dragonflies, 
Tizanoptera thrips, Neuroptera lace wings, Psychoptera bark with lices, Megaloptera alderflies, Hymenoptera on soft lice, Diptera on different families of flies, Hemiptera true barks and leafhoppers, and Lepidoptera butterflies and moths, and on some beetles, order coming up of Coleoptera. Let's. So these are pr samples of different egg masses of different insects, which are hosts of the family Trichogrammatidae, which I am studying taxonomy, biology, biodiversity, material from different countries. So here material will be presented about Turkish Republic. So what's about most interesting? This is a genus Trichogramma in the family Trichogrammatidae because of commercial application of a genus of a species of a genus Trichogramma in biological or agricultural crops. This is a model object for laboratory study of biology, physiology of insects. And also this is a model object for molecular and genetical studies. Here I show just a few examples of a family, of adults of a family Trichogrammatidae. Here we can say that 10 species of Trichogramma were studied and are recorded in Turkish Republic according to the literature. 25 species and 9 genera of a family Trichogrammatidae were previously recorded in Turkish Republic. And according to my research, we did, I did identification of species of Trichogramma in agricultural crops in the regions near Ankara. So 5 species of Trichogramma were identified. And identified also material of egg parasitoids of family Trichogrammatidae. Nine genera of Trichogrammatidae were collected, I identified, deposited in collection on, on the base of material collected in Anakara and some surrounded areas. Here, for instance, just I'm collecting material with one of methods. This is a method using yellow pen traps when we use yellow plates filled with water, with salted water, with shampoo. So some parasitoids flying like attracted to the yellow light. So they fall down in the water with shampoo and they drawn inside. So they are fixed in salt. And then later they were just cleaned in fresh water and just deposited in 70% ethanol. So let's talk about another families which were collected. Family Euritamidae, such species like Bruchophagus saphore and two species of a genus Euritoma were collected. This was not my major purpose, this was additional material I collected in different agricultural areas. And this is description, this is a photo of Bruchophagus saphore, female of Bruchophagus saphore evapositing in the fresh pod of a plant, Sophora. So this is Phytophagus species, which is ovipositing inside the pod, and so larvae are seed feeders on seed of Sophora. Euritamida family has a pre is presented uh, widely, definitely, so more species will be collected in the future and have been collected but not identified yet. Just on some, in the many samples, definitely this material for a future study. Here, this is indication of tropical connections of a family Euritamidae with five, with six orders of, of five orders of insects, and one is Aranea. So, Euritamidae, they are egg. To parasitoids on Hymenoptera, on such families as Braconidae, Ichneumonidae, Cynipidae, Apidae. They are recorded as egg parasitoids on some grasshoppers, Titigonidae family. They are predaceous insects, larvae on, are on some eggs of spiders. Trichor or Euritamidae family is recorded as ectoparasitoids on butterflies, ectoparasitoids of flies of family. Tephrotidae and Cecidomidae, and they are widely polyphagous and phytophagous species, 
seed feeding insects on different plants of different families such as Fabaceae, Umbilates, Umbilifera, Rosaceae, Anacardiaceae, Graminae and many others. And many species are recorded as a primary ectoparasitoids of beetles such as weevils and borrow wood boring insects of scolitinae. Okay, here for instance here yeah, I'm collecting material in some areas which are steppe regions around Ankara, steppe hills with some different flowers and steppe plantations. Okay, family tree, uh, Torimide, Torimide. Here there are some pictures of Torimide, including female of Megastigmus, which is ovipositing in fruits of wild rosa, rosa rugosa. So we collected some material of Megastigmus species, genus. Torimide family has connections with seven orders of insects. These are Hymenoptera, Mantodea, Heteroptera, Homoptera, Diptera, Lepidoptera, and Coleoptera. Family Ormiridae, very colorful, very interesting. Phytophagous insects. One genus, one species of a genus Ormiride, Ormirus was collected. Here some field collecting. I'm collecting material in the Yenimahale region in the center of Ankara. So family Leucospide. Leucospide family is very specific because you can see here this is female with very extended long ovipositor which is turned on the back of a body just over the abdomen. So very special structure of ovipositor and total morphological structure. The ectoparasitoids of many different solitary bees such as Megahelidae and, and some also wasps, mostly solitary as Euminidae and Sphicidae, but some others also are possible. Okay, family. Calcidide, one of the biggest in size parasitoids. We have a very robust shape, strong body, in many cases curved hind legs, curved tibia and, and femora, and they have wide tropical relations with four orders of insects, with Hymenoptera, with Neuroptera, Diptera, and Coleoptera. So they're indicated as endoparasitoids of different species of insects, parasitoids of pupae and larvae of different insects, indicated on this slide. Okay, some material was studied also in the laboratory of biocontrol in plant research center in Ankara. So, and also we did different field research in different areas near Ankara and other areas, like to Adana in Biological Control Institute. This is on the south, in the west, southern place of Turkish Republic. And Sarkaria, this is on the west from Turkish Republic, oh, from Ankara. Okay, here, for instance, we are collecting material near Adana, and also in this, this material was collected near Injirliova in city. Here, meeting with some colleagues from Injirliova Plant Protection and Inspection in Jinliova and in Dinisli, west part of the Turkish Republic. Okay, family, Pteromalidae. We have a very wide tropical relations with many orders of insects. So the, one of the biggest family of, of calcid wasps. For instance, here, on the left photo, we can see Pteromalidae is a hyperparasitoid of a Braconidae family, of Braconidae wasps, so secondary hyperparasitoid or secondary parasitoid of Braconidae family. So Pteromalidae has connection with six orders of insects, including lysis, flies, 
leaf hoppers, different bugs, different soft lice, wasps, parasitic wasps including as a hyperparasitoid of different wasps and including parasit and the hull, hull makers and of family Cynipida, ectoparasitoids of some weevils and wood boring insects of a family Anobiida and parasitoids of larvae and pupae of butterflies of families Papilionidae, Pioridae, Nymphalidae and many others. Not in the list because here too long list of a different families of hosts. Some of them I indicated on slide. Okay, here some pictures of a field research near Denisli on the south of the south western part of Turkish Republic, where we were collected material on family Argaonidae, including in Ankara with this Argaonidae were found in, in near Ankara as well, but in Denisli and in generally over in Adana were widely spread. This is pollinator of injure tree, Lastophagopsianus. Okay, family Tetracampidae, genus Tetracampa. Family Eupelmidae, genus Calasota anastatos. Eupelmidae, family has very heavy connections with eight orders of insects and one. Uh, part is recorded as a predaceous insects, predaceous larvae on spiders' eggs. So the uh, parasitic on Neuroptera, on Orthoptera, Diptera, Heteroptera, Hymenoptera, and beetles Coleoptera, and also the recorded as ectoparasitoids, as endoparasitoids, and also as egg parasitoids on grasshoppers. So a very wide variety of host relations in the family Eopilmidae. Again here picture of our colleagues of Tur from Turkish Republic during field trips, field research visits different areas. For instance here the material collected in a springtime collected eggs of Archips rosana you see on the right side a picture of a males of Trichogramodendrolemi, which were reared from these eggs. And they were bred in the laboratory on the host of a laboratory moths. Here we see just this species of Trichogramodendrolemi, parasitizing egg of night moths, Noctoidae family. Here, Trichogramma. Pinte or brassica, which is used for breeding in laboratory culture. Okay, field collecting was done, for instance, in some agricultural areas like cabbage fields, where many species of butterflies and night moths are spread, so they lay eggs, so it's possible to find many natural material of eggs, especially in non sprayed in but in some fields without sprayed pesticides, so butterflies were flying very well, so they laying eggs. From these eggs, some material of a trichogramma were collected for laboratory breeding and for laboratory study. Also, uh, was materials some material of larval parasitoids of a family Braconidae, and some material of parasitoids of Hamoptera from a genus. Aphidius as parasitoid of aphids. Here, for instance, here this was collecting in this cabbage field during field research visits. And here in the southern place in Ankara, near Adana, was collected some material of different families, including Betelidae, Mimaridae, Serafronidae. Celeonides and Braconidae, for instance. Okay, our field collecting was continued during our trip, so we stopped in some areas near agricultural field crops, like the special commercial fields of Henopodium. Some material was studied and collected near this commercial field, and these are men in the center, they are just hosts, uh, businessmen who 
we breed in these different agricultural crops and this is their own field, so they kindly allowed us to collect material for scientific purpose, definitely. Okay, family Mimaridae, they are egg parasitoids. Some genera and some species were found in our material. Mimaridae, they have a tropical connections with eight orders of different insects, including dragonflies, bark lices, leafhoppers, true bugs, eggs of moths, and eggs of beetles, and eggs of grasshoppers. So here you see some collecting near the roadsides, near some streams, with some green plants even in a very hot time in summer season. But this is a very simple roadside with many weeds, so green weeds are a good place for collecting different entomological material, including parasitic wasps. Family Eola feeder here indicates some pictures with larval parasitoids and pupil parasitoids. Nine genera were collected in our material, so biodiversity is much larger, So, but this was not our primary subject for study, but some material were collected with different genera of the family Eolophidae. And Eolophidae, we have a wide variety of hosts, so about nine orders of insects, and also some species indicated as predaceous on galmites, predaceous on worms, of nematode worms, and they were recorded in scientific literature, definitely. And as ectoparasitoids, endoparasitoids, and also as a hyperparasitoids or secondary parasitoids on other different insects of nine orders, which, in, which were indicated here on this slide. This is our visit to biological control laboratory in Adana, meeting with colleagues from university and meeting Chukurova University in Adana and also Biological Control Laboratory in Adana. Family Aphelinidae were just parasitoids of different insects. Four genera were found in our material, including this genus Aphelinus, parasitoid of different second insects, Aphids, and other genera as well. Family Signiforidae. There's some collecting near Adana with Professor Miktat Daghanlar, who very kindly showed us different plantations, plants, different natural habitats for finding interesting material. Here we started, we looked for some material on some pine trees together with Miktat Daghanlar, famous Turkish researcher of calcid wasps. Here we collected material near Ankara in special small place named Chubuk and Karaol Lake where it was found one interesting parasitoid of a genus Hetostrichella in yellow pentraps near the lake. Probably this is aquatic parasitoid because it was collected just near the edge of a lake but host still unknown, despite the species quite big, about one millimeter size. One millimeter size is, a very, is quite big for family Trichoromatidae. In Chubuk, several other families of Hymenoptera were collected, including Diaporidae, Braconidae, Seraphronidae, Celionidae, and others. Very simple, but very careful method of collecting, of using Sweeping net or butterfly net was used as well, so I collected material again near roadsides and green areas. And here, together with our Turkish colleagues. Family Ensertide, six junior work found in our material. Here we see the picture of polyembrani of genus Capidasoma. Just Mummy, you can see here, the mummy of caterpillar, of this night moth. Huge caterpillar, which is dry, including 
many, many uh, different embryos and just cocoons. And on the right slide, just so many individuals of Capitasoma just rear it from these cocoons. From one cocoon, more than 100 spe specimens were reared. Family Ensertidae, uh, representative of family Ensertidae, has, we have a different trophical relations with eight orders of insects and also with some spiders, eggs, and also with some Exodidae mites. So we may have very important role as biocontrol of mites, including especially Exodidae ticks. So now eight orders of hosts from the orders Neuroptera, Orthoptera, Diptera, Homoptera, Heteroptera, Hymenoptera, Coleoptera, and Lepidoptera. So Ensertidae parasitoids were endoparasitoids, we are egg parasitoids, we are parasitoids of larvae, and also we are recorded as hyperparasitoids of uh, different insects. In indicated on this slide, hyperparasitoids of many families of the order Hymenoptera as well, on the right side. So you see Aphelinids, we are parasitoids of Aphelinids, Ensertids, the same family, Pteromalids, Braconids, and even Drinids. Okay, you see, we are collect continuing here, collecting near Bursa, here this is on the north, west part of the Turkish Republic. Family, Eucharitidae, these are parasitoids of Formicidae ants. I have shown them you in some videos. Ectoparasitoids of Hymenoptera, larvae and pupae of ants, Formicoidae. So, and the larvae is very special, the larvae is very active, as Planidio actively searching for host for, and just on using the ant, the adult of ant as a for for forage coming inside the nest of ants for parasitization of larvae and pupae in the nest of ants. Family Perilampidae, very special shape of body, very robust body, strong body. Some material was found. Perilampidae parasitoids have connection with four orders of insects, including some flies, Rushhoppers, some parasitic wasps, and some soft flies, and some beetles. Different families were primary parasitoids, and are well indicated as hyperparasitoids or secondary parasitoids. So this is a review for different families with some trophical connections. I wanted to show precisely indicate different connections with different families of hosts to show that parasitoids of a superfamily Calcididae, we have a very wide variety of hosts. So we are widely distributed all around the world in different countries. We are following to the host. So where host is coming, so the parasitoids are coming for following their host. So that's why we are distributed in different localities, in different environments. And so, and some Hosts unknown and many, you can say, many hosts which are distri widely distributed in nature. We can know the host, but we can know who, who is the host of the, this species or that species of parasitoid because it's quite difficult to make biological observation for the host and to breed parasitoid from the body of host, making very careful observation, sometimes even dissections, flowery of adults, pupae of hosts to find larva to be sure that this host is a real host for this parasitoid, not only just living nearby, because in many cases sometimes collected material associated with parasitoid, but in reality we are just living in the same environment, near the same plant. It doesn't mean that we, this host is precisely the host of this parasitoid. It is very careful observation of biology to see, to record the oviposition inside the host or on the host, or just to dissect 
the larva, the body of adult or just pupa or eggs of parasitoid of host to find larva or egg of parasitoid. In this case, these trophical connections will be really very precisely identified and we can say we can indicate it on camera on photos and publish in scientific literature. So here are some results about study of family tree hermatidae collected in different environment. Here material was collected on 14 families and 59 species of parasitic calcid wasps of different families. So and also studied the biodiversity of parasitic wasps in natural air environment of Turkish Republic. Here some acknowledgments to my colleagues and chiefs in Ankara and I was supported by the grant of Tubitak program and so far so good. Thank you for your attention about the pre my presentation of these photographs and these original photographs including the tropical relations of different parasitoids. So this was a presentation of about my presentation about biodiversity of different parasitic wasps of a superfamily Calcidae and also superfamily Ichneumonidae, which I have collected and studied and during my visit to Turkish Republic, where I studied material of the family Trichochromatidae and other Calcid wasps in National Agricultural Research Center in Ankara, and also I visited some other areas during my field and research trips to different laboratories and different field stations, different field sites during my research so several years ago. So that's why I repeated it to show you the biodiversity of insects and the biodiversity of the hosts, hosts of parasitoids from different families, just in order to show you this complex of relations between hosts, hosts are bigger usually, and very small parasitoids which are attacking their hosts in their natural environment. So I hope so. This was interesting for you to see this wide biodiversity of insects, wide connections between different groups of insects, and to understand that each host usually may have a parasitoid or a group of several parasitoids in general, as it's recorded in literature, from three, five, or even up to eight species of parasitoids can be developing on one species of host, or even more. In some cases, even several dozens of species, parasitoids from different groups of parasitic wasps, they are using the same host, host is widely distribution, distributed and can be used as a Good meal for many species of parasitoids. Thank you for your attention. Welcome to my channel for next time. Don't forget to press like, write, your com write a little bit comments about your interest, about your questions, about your little bit your comments regarding your personal material of collecting, of your personal interest. So you can indicate, like here, have you collected? Have you collected parasitic wasps? So, thank you for coming. Welcome to the world of parasitoids or parasitic wasps. To be continued in my next video, don't switch off next time. New video is coming soon. And don't forget, Ukraine is forever. Welcome to my channel. Press like, write your comments, visit my Patreon page. Link is down video in the description of the video to support our channel financially. Not only morally, financially, morally, you can write comment, comment, comment. It's also useful for development of our channel because if you write more comments, more comments, it will be multiplying little bit, little bit, step by step, showing to other people, to other channels. So because comments, this is a feedback of viewers. Don't hesitate to write your comment in English or in your own language. It will be helpful. Not for me precisely, but to the channel, 
precisely to this video, YouTube will push it forward and will show it for more people, for more biologists, for more amateurs, for more people who is interested in the nature and especially in insects. Welcome to the study of parasitic wasps. Good luck, see you soon. Ukraine is forever. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the next video as well. Good luck. See you soon on my channel. Thank you for your attention.